Hello Taurus, welcome to my channel. My name is Ashley. I'll be doing your weekly love reading. Oops, where was that? Hmm. Keep in mind this will not resonate with all Tauruses out there. This is a general love reading. So please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Um, if this is not your story, please don't force it. Leave it for who it was meant to reach. Today we'll be looking at how your person's feeling, how you're feeling towards your person, and the mutual energy between you both, and then we'll get some love messages. If you haven't already, please like and subscribe to the channel. I am also booking personal readings now, so if you would like to book, go ahead and shoot me an email. Everything is in the description below. Okay, so let's see what we have here. Let me fix it. Okay. So let's start with the signs. You have pentacles. You could be dealing with another Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. We have wands. So you could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. You could be dealing with a Gemini with the lover's card here. You could also be dealing with any air sign um gemini libra aquarius i don't see any swords so you could be dealing with any sign really these are just the most dominant signs that are popping up in the reading due to them being in your person's chart or your chart so don't get too caught up on that so let's get started for your person taurus <clears throat> we have the judgment in reverse Two of Pentacles in reverse, Page of Pentacles in reverse, and the Eight of Pentacles upright. So for your person, I feel like they're coming out of their head, Taurus. Hmm. Okay, this is what I'm getting. And keep in mind, if this is how you're feeling, not your person, go ahead and flip the roles. Sometimes the energies come in reverse, so flip it as need be. Everybody's situation is going to be different. Let's see. It's a little, little better. Okay, so for your person, Taurus, I feel like they're coming out of their head. I feel like they're finally getting out of their head. They're finally having like a poof moment, like an aha, like... This is what I need to do. They're finally waking up is how I'm feeling. They're finally waking up. They're coming out of their head with this two of pentacles. Or maybe they, they're stopping whatever whatever they're juggling. They're coming out of that. Like, why am I doing this? I need to stop. Get out of my head. I'm going to stop doing this. You know, maybe they owed you an apology or they never they never gave you an offer. And they're coming out of that. You know, they're, they're finally waking up saying... What am I doing? This is what I need to do. I need to give Taurus either an apology or an offer, and I need to work at it. I need to to come out of my head, and I need to work at it with, with Taurus. Or this could be them working on themselves, working on their money. We'll clarify that here in just a few. So in your energy, Taurus, I see that we have the Five of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, the Page of Cups, and the Lovers. So I feel, Taurus, that you've been waiting for an offer from this person. I, I feel like this person hasn't given you much of an offer, a stable offer. I feel like they, they've abandoned you before. They've, they've made you feel neglected before. They've neglected you in the past probably by not expressing how they feel or maybe coming in and out of your life so much. And you felt abandoned. You felt left out. And because this person's been in and out of your life so much, maybe they only come in like on a late night. You know, maybe they only come call for you. Maybe they only call you when... 
when it's convenient for them is what I'm feeling and you feel left out and maybe that's what this is now they're finally waking up saying you know maybe I need to work at it and actually give my Taurus an offer here because I see that's what you want Taurus in your energy you have page of cups and the lovers you want an offer you want to be with this person you want to be with this person you want I feel like you feel you guys are meant to be together. Taurus, I feel like you feel like a higher a higher power brought you two together. All you want is this person. But this person is so in and out. And, and you can see it here. They were juggling. They weren't giving you an offer. But I feel like now they're wanting to come back and work at it. In the mutual energy, I see it. I see that there was not a love offer, uh, you know, on either side. Either you weren't showing emotion or love or nobody made a love offer to, to each other. And you all are coming out of this confused state of energy, um, dropping all options, getting out of the clouds, head out of the clouds. You see that with your person. They're waking up. They're waking up here with this judgment in reverse. They're waking up. They're coming out of their head. Um, out of juggling they could have dropped any other option that they were um, um, entertaining they could have had options and now they're dropping them and maybe you're coming out of this confused state because you didn't know if they liked you kind of like you know do you like me or not you, you they weren't giving you an offer they were in and out they weren't showing emotion and you guys are coming out of that so let's clarify the energies Please clarify Taurus's this person. Yeah, they want to give to you now. In the past, it wasn't equal. And now they're coming out of this and they want, they want to bring balance. They want to work at it. They want to bring balance back to the connection because they didn't do that before. You know, maybe they're not financially stable either. Um, and it's been a, a long, slow process, but now they're finally coming out of that. And they want to bring balance. They want to finally give back to you. Yeah, Taurus. So some secrets may have came out. Some secrets may have came out. Or you're coming to the realization about who this person is. Let's see. Give me one more for Taurus's energy. already please subscribe and to the channel and like the video let's see Taurus I feel like you're you're gonna have a decision something's gonna be revealed to you this person may reveal their feelings to you with this moon here in reverse something's gonna come out you're gonna find something out and you're gonna have a choice with this two of swords here this is you with the power, Taurus. This is you. I feel like you're going to be caught off guard with whatever, whatever is revealed to you, you're going to be caught off guard. This person is blindfolded in the middle of nowhere. It's going to hit you out of nowhere. And you're going to have a decision to make, a choice to make. And you're going to be weighing out your options. You see, she's looking at her two swords trying to figure out which one to take and I feel like one of them is should I walk away or should I work at it because you also receive the eight of cups someone walking away huh give me one for the mutual energy please okay yeah so we have the four of cups you guys are in mourning you guys are disappointed. This person may be disappointed in themselves and you're disappointed possibly in them, but I feel like possibly in yourself as well. Maybe you saw the red flags and you didn't, you're disappointed in yourself because you didn't leave when you saw the red flags or you didn't, you still, pursued this person when you saw red flags is what I'm getting. That That's not for everybody, so take that as it resonates. This is not everyone's story. Everyone's situation is different, but 
this person may be drinking a lot, but they're mourning. They're they're deep in thought and they're they're contemplating their options. And I I feel like they feel bad. And I feel like you feel bad as well. You guys are just both contemplating on the situation. But there's definitely sadness here. Disappointment. Disappointment is what I'm getting most out of this card. So let's get some love messages for you, Taurus. Please give me three messages to Taurus from their person. Interference. Okay, so there's something interfering with your connection. Um, hmm, let's get some more on that. I pray for you. So you may have prayed for this person or this person feels like you are everything that they've been praying for. You may have everything to offer this person and they feel like you're everything they could want. Oh, okay. So you drive me crazy. So this person is definitely in their head about you. But we also have I use you for money slash sex. So this could be the interference and this could be why you're disappointed and why you have a choice to make. Maybe you see it. You know, under the deck we have what I said or did to you still haunts me. So this is somebody from your past, definitely. Um, maybe this is why they've never really brought, maybe the interference is why they've never really brought you a stable offer. Give me one more. I'm gonna pull one more for you, Taurus. One more, one more. Codependency. So that's what, that could be the choice you have to make, Taurus. You know, is this person codependent? Does this person use you? Um, either way, I feel like they're in their feelings over you. I feel like they're sad and they're mourning this connection. Um, but that's what I have for you this week, Taurus. If that resonates, Leave me a comment below and like the video. If not, please leave it here for who it was meant to reach. If you want a personal reading with me, look in the description below. I'm sending you lots of love, light, and clarity. And I hope you have a great rest of your week. And I will talk to you next week.